Hey, hey friends! So, today we are starting a new project, but just remember to create it using the 2D project option. And here we add 2D tile map. If you know how tile maps work, that's really good, <laughs> but we are going to go a bit over that as well here. Okay, so now we have this grid all properly divided in tiles. But how do we change anything here? Well, we need to find the tile palette window. I'm going to attach that here. And to add new tiles, we need a palette. We don't have one, so we need to create one. Let's call it palette one, create. We have this folder that we just created there. And all right, now to our sprites folder, I want you to create a white square. You can use paint or whatever, just create a 64 by 64 white square. If it is not immediately recognized as a, as a sprite, it would be on default here, just change it to Sprite 2D and apply. Then you'll drag here and drop there on the tile. And we have a folder for that. It can be called white square, that's fine. Okay, and now here we got our white square. Select the paintbrush and add one of those square here. And that's kind of nice, but the square is a bit smaller than the actual grid square. And why is that? Well, because our white square is 64 by 64 and the sprite is set to need 100 pixels to use up a whole unit. So what is a unit? It takes one unit from here to here. All the sides of these grid squares are one by one. So we change here to 64, and it properly occupies the whole grid square. Okay, though you may agree with this or not, it's perfectly fine. Since we are going to use this project to test different pathfinding algorithms, this might not be the best, since it's hard to check here the limits of each grid square. So I'm going to use a different value here. 80, it's probably fine. If you want to use another value, that's okay as well. All right. And what else we have for today? Where is this? Okay, I need to erase all this. Okay, I want a map that is 20 by 20. Okay, where the zero starts. Okay, here is zero. Okay, and we stop on 19 because it starts on zero. So it's 20 up and it needs to be 20 to the side as well. Okay, and here is 19 by 19. In case you are wondering, the camera is completely off. So let's go a bit to the side here. And up. I think 10 10 is perfect. Opa. 10 10. And then we just need to increase the camera size. 11 is alright. So that was it for today. Thanks for watching and see you next time.